Hey guys, Sleep Grandma here. Um, I just wanted to do a little gratitude list today. Um, I'm always doing gratitude lists because I always have something to be grateful for. But um, if you like my videos, please give them a like. Please smash that button and um, subscribe. Hopefully you'll subscribe. Um, you know, yesterday I, I hadn't been feeling well for the last week. You know, on and off, kind of nauseous, kind of. And I don't usually get nauseous because I... Um, you know, I eat a bunch of weird stuff and I never get nauseous. But uh, anyway, so I'd been feeling some things, you know, and I was just like kind of ignoring them, some symptoms coming and going. So finally yesterday, the symptoms came on real strong and I ended up going to the emergency room uh, to, you know, for a UT, UTI, urinary tract infection. Anyway, um, yeah, so it turns out I have it really bad and... Uh, I'm here outside the pharmacy right now waiting for my medication. But, um, you know, as I drove to the doctor last night, I thought to myself, God, I'm so lucky that I get to go to the doctor, that I um, have medical insurance and I can go and um, <laughs> have this taken care of. You know, is it life or death? I don't know how bad. You know, I know that sometimes UTIs can turn into... Um, kidney infections and then you're like really you know it's you can go into kidney failure all kinds of stuff but and I and I was grateful that I could actually just jump in the car because I have a car and I could just drive to the hospital which is like what like seven minutes away I was grateful that um that the hospital so close to me and that they were really nice at the hospital uh, at Wellstar Hospital over here in Hiram and uh it's just, it's just, you know, a series of things I'm grateful for. Now today, my oldest child um, is driving back to New Jersey and um, she was here for about three weeks and I got to see her probably about three, three times, three or four times. She spent a couple of days with me and I am just grateful that, um, that I got to see her, you know, and um, I'm grateful that my grandchild is still, still here. My grown grandchild's still here. I'm going to get to see her. She's going to come over and spend a couple of days with me. But the point I'm trying to make, guys, is that um, I, I'm grateful for everything today. I'm grateful for my health. I'm grateful I'm sober. I'm grateful um, that I have, you know, good people in my life. I'm grateful that I have a very strong foundation today because there was years and years that I didn't have a, a great sense of self. And today I have that. I also have um, another thing I'm grateful for. At this point, I mean, I'm 63 years old. At this point in my life, I'm not responsible for a husband, a boyfriend, uh, uh, um, you know, a child. You're telling me they're hungry. I mean, it's, I kind of do whatever I want whenever I want to. And um, if I had to, I would, I mean, if I met somebody special, you know, obviously I would, I would want to. Um share my life but um but I um I'm grateful to just be able to do whatever I want to do because for the longest time I mean, all my life I've always um everyone else was the top priority so I'm grateful that today I can um just do whatever I want to do and I love that so just um the reason I'm making this video because I want to remind you guys to be grateful every day for everything everything you know there's a lot of people that uh can don't have a car to go to the hospital don't have medical insurance right now i'm going to go in and get my medication and because i have medical insurance it's going to cost me maybe ten ten dollars um a lot of people can't do that you know um i somebody i read an article someone had gone in for like a cut finger or something it was four thousand dollars it's ridiculous i mean things out of control so um I'm just really lucky that I can do all those things today. And um, I just want to remind you that if you, if you live in gratitude, you will find something to be grateful for. Today, today I challenge you guys. I want to challenge you guys to um, put in the comment section one or two things that you're grateful for. You know, I used to not live in gratitude. I just thought that I was missing something and everybody else was happier and I was always wanting, wanting, wanting. 
Today I am completely grateful for what I already have and I can really feel the gratitude and that's the important part to um, to be able really to appreciate the fact that I could walk into the store and, and get some um, you know sparkle glue to draw a picture of my granddaughter and send it to her and just so many things I have my my oldest daughter and my niece are their birthdays coming up and um, I have the income that I can send them a birthday gift and that that's beautiful a lot of people can't do that a lot of people just to have to give a happy birthday and say okay well you know sorry but uh but you know giving excuses and uh I had the funds to help you know some people so I'm just really grateful so just try to stay grateful and try to stay aware of um your surroundings you know the beautiful tree just appreciate every moment because um we never know when the last time we saw someone is the last time we we're going to see that person you know last year at this time we never imagined we'd be in the middle of a pandemic so, um, and now I feel like I took a lot of things for granted, especially going to the movie theater. I really miss that, <laughs> but um, it's funny the things you miss, but you know, when I hugged my daughter goodbye, I just, just held on to her because I, you know, we're not even really supposed to be hugging each other. So yes, just, I'm just grateful to have been able to spend time with her and I'm grateful to be able to make videos for you. I hope you find some comfort in my videos. So, um, appreciate what you already have, guys, and um, let's make it a good day moment by moment. Hang in there. Don't lose the faith. Um, we won't make it through this. This is just a bump in the road. And um, hopefully you'll wear your mask, I mean, so we can be done with this stuff, you know, and get, a, get back to our um, lives, you know, um, I don't know. Anyway, love you guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And, um, I hope you think about what I said, because sometimes we need to hear from someone else so we can, um, absorb it. Okay. Bye.